going to a restaurant tonight that Nut's old school friend told her about and you'd never find it. So we're just leaving the hotel now. We'll head out to the main road. It's about a five minute drive roughly, depending on traffic. It's a long road to get out of the hotel. Love the tree lined road to get in. Now we've only been here once or been past this afternoon in the light, it's a bit dark now. So we're going to try and find it again in the dark. It's in the middle of a housing, gated housing area. What's the name of the restaurant on? I've forgotten the name of the restaurant. Eat em up, I think it's called. Eat em up? Eat em up. Eat em up. Eat em up. What is it in time? Jump my die, is it? Oh. I don't remember. Japanese companies here, Toyota, A1 papers made here, the hard, lots of hard drives, lots of computer components, all made here in Bratchenbury, big expat community, a big Japanese expat community actually. So I think we're going to turn right up here. resident here. Yep. Just up past maybe yeah. Yeah in here, in here. In here. This is where the car coming up. Okay. Very surprised this is a gated community but there's so many small businesses here, it's unbelievable. on the menu but Nut said there's a heap of stuff she wants to try and it's a couple of things on there that I should like. And lots of things that you would like. Lots of things, okay. Lots of things. okay. So I'm going to be very happy eating tonight, am I? You will be happy eating. Drinks, steaks. Steaks? Pasta. 
pasta, Thai food. In the middle of nowhere. Isan food. Oh, sad boy. It's full of children and full of bikes, which is good to see. This house in front of us is being renovated. Just a small two bedroom, which is all you need when you retire up here. How do you know two bedrooms? It's a two bedroom. One bedroom there, one bedroom there, the lounge room and kitchen in the middle. Small. It's very small. Here we are at Eatem Up. Pretty cool. They've even got the Christmas decorations still on the door. They haven't missed out on Christmas after all. Merry Christmas. I want to sit in my lounge chair. Yeah. I'm glad we didn't miss out on Christmas this year. Isn't that wonderful? 